The Sony Master Series Anonymity J line of TV has an impressively bright OLED panel with one of the widest color ranges we've seen, along with powerful audio performance on par with dedicated speakers, making it worth the high cost of entry. Sony is no stranger to OLED TV and impressed us with the Master Anon G series when we tested it two years ago. The Master Series Anon DJ is Sony's latest flagship OLED model, as well as its best TV to date. It's one of the brightest OLED panels we've had in the lab, with one of the widest color gamuts, and it offers advanced features including far-field microphones for hands-free Google Assistant voice control, and an XR sound system that's good enough to replace a dedicated soundbar. It's undoubtedly pricey at $2,999.99 for the 55-inch XR55 Anonymity J we tested, but it's a worthy home theater splurge that easily earns our Editor's Choice Award. A premium design, the Anonymity J is a slim, simple, and stylish. The glass of the OLED panel runs edge to edge, with only a quarter-inch black border around the active picture. The bottom of the screen holds the only bezel, a similarly narrow brush metal strip that holds the DD far field microphones and indicator light. The aluminum laminated OLED panel is only a fraction of an inch thick, but the back of the TV thickens out to 1.6 inches of plastic casings for the electronics that drive the screen and the two actuators mounted behind the panel that provide the sound. Two narrow, rectangular, gunmetal feet keep the Anonymity J upright on flat surfaces. By default, the feet simply hold the TV stable with the bottom of the screen nearly flush with your entertainment console. The feet can also be rotated to lift the TV up a few inches, in case you want to place a soundbar under it. The 83-inch model has a third configuration that moves the feet from the edges of the TV closer to the middle, so you can place the big screen on a surface that isn't as wide as it is. All ports and connections, except for the power cable, sit on the left side of the back of the TV. An HDMI port, two USB ports, a 3.5mm headphone jack, a 3.5-inch combination composite video input and center speaker channel input, a 3.5-inch remote receiver, and a pair of speaker terminals for the center speaker channel face left. The center speaker channel inputs let you connect in a slash V receiver to use the TV built-in speakers to serve as a center channel for a larger surround system. Three more HDMI ports, another USB port, an Ethernet port, a 3.5-inch RS-232C port, an optical audio output, and an antenna slash cable connector face downward, just past the left facing port. Two of the HDMI ports, 3E and 4 are 4 cone 120 capable. The other two only support 4K sick. The included remote is button laden but elegant, thanks to a brushed metal plate on top giving it a sense of premium quality. It's a long, slim wand with a circular navigation pad in the middle, a number pad, and dedicated service buttons for Amazon Prime Video, Disney Plus, Netflix, and YouTube sit above the navigation panel, along with a Google Assistant button and a pinhole microphone. Volume and channel rockers and playback control sit below the pad. It feels comfortable in the hand and connects wirelessly to the TV so you don't need direct line of sight to use it. Google TV and Google Assistant Sony is moving on from Android TV as its preferred smart platform in favor of Google TV. It's effectively an upgraded, streamlined version of Android TV, providing largely the same apps, services, and features, but with a friendlier interface that more readily aggregates and recommends content. All of the big streaming services are here, including Apple TV, Amazon Prime Video, Disney+, HBO Max, Hulu, Netflix, Twitch. You can mirror your phone, tablet, or computer screen to the TV using Apple AirPlay or Google Cast. Standout sound. Speakers are usually a perfunctory aspect of a TV. Typically, a set of downward-firing drivers a handful of watts each to provide enough sound to easily hear what you're watching. Sony put more thought than this into the Anonymity J's XR sound system, combining conventional drivers with actuators mounted behind the screen. The TV features a pair of 10-watt actuators for higher frequencies and a pair of 20-watt drivers for lower frequencies. For more audio power than typical TV, an OLED worth splurging on. The Sony Master Series Anonymity J is a fantastic example of a flagship. It's very expensive, yes but it offers an excellent picture with plenty of brightness for an OLED panel and one of the widest color gamuts we've seen in any TV. It's also packed full of features thanks to Google TV and its far-field microphones, including hands-free Google Assistant voice control, throw in strong audio and gaming performance, and the Anonymity J easily earns our Editor's Choice Award. If you want a good picture and lots of features, but don't want to spend nearly as much money, check out the aforementioned Hisense H9G. It uses Android TV, 
which is a bit less streamlined than Google TV. But it also offers hands-free Google Assistant and provides very strong picture quality, including much higher brightness than any consumer OLED is capable of. You can also consider Vizio's OLED TV series, which isn't as bright as the Anonity J and doesn't have quite as many smart features and no voice assistant, but still offers an excellent picture for less than half the price. We are going to end this video right away. If you have any query or information to share, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.